Welcome back students, hope you all are done with your exams in a well-mannered way upon uh, the following my important questions for the different courses which I have posted earlier and this is the last exam for the 4-2 semester, hope you are going to perform well even in the course total quality management upon the request of many students texting me on insta as well as on the youtube comments so i'm going to work out for you all these important questions if you feel any other questions other than these are important please go through even that also it is all about the uh, total quality management and the course is too lengthy in certain units and you are supposed to work out in bulletin points to score a better mark as it is a theory subject many students fail in the course and do concentrate even on your handwriting dear students tqm principles and concepts is a short question tqm process of implementation and define the quality may be the short as well as the long question history and development of quality management and the charts used to evaluate the quality of attributes explain this term from this we can expect 2a as well as 2b from a to j a product inspection versus process control is said to be the topmost question which may occur this time in the question paper methods of statistical quality control and the objectives of quality control is a short question acceptance sampling and the control charts are very important from the part of the unit one attitude and involvement of the top management explain the term and the culture and the management system this is said to be the 3a as well as 3b dear students please do concentrate in your handwriting as it is a theory subject later i have come up with the fourth and the fifth question benefits on pitfalls pitfalls or the term failure may be the same here of benchmarking and the procedure of the benchmarking and the evolution of benchmarking related to benchmarking please try to work out one question will be damn sure in the question paper customer focus and the internal and the external customer focus as well as the internal customer conflict and how it is going to improve and the quality focus is set to be the short question the role of marketing and sales related to the marketing and sales you are going to get one question for sure in form of 5a 5b internal customer conflict conflict and the different models available to measure the customer satisfaction explain the term customer views in the TQM may be the short question this is all about 5AB and 4AB dear students this is a part of unit 2 later the unit 3 is bit length in its structure if you want you can skip it as the last moment if any student is looking to just pass can skip the third unit but whereas for the benefit of the other students have worked out even the fourth unit, third unit also the seven tools of tqm quality circle is the topmost question and the generic strategy for organizing quality implementation also the topmost question organizing structure of the tqm this is set to be the sixth question and the seventh question and laker is square diagram as well as scatter diagram out of this two you'll be getting one question kept network model and the steps involved in it and the business forms categorized the different uh, business forms and the role checklist sheet in locating the quality problem as well as part to and targo methodology is also set to be the topmost question as it is lengthy i was telling you if you are not interested to work out you can skip this unit later you are done we're going to work out with the eighth and the ninth question accounting account system under tqm is set to be the topmost question and the quality management the short question the role is asked in accounting system that may be the long question and the cost of quality is set to be the topmost question related to the cost of quality they will be asking any part of the question that may be in term of 8a 8b as well as in the short question dear student cost of quality and categories about the cost of quality and histogram and bar chart problems sometimes is asked the process cost approach reporting the cost of quality explain this term that may be 9a 9b and i'm not going to highlight any short questions in few topics you are supposed to be thorough with all the long questions so that you could be able to work out the short as well as long i can give you the one of the gun short question related to the fifth unit that is about the 10th and the 11th is it's all about i ISO 9000 please be clear with certain points related to ISO 9000 this question answer you're going to do it in the first in the examination you need to elaborately explain each and every steps related to ISO you need to work out like their objectives first later their benefits and what are the basic requirements put the heading and write down if some question occurs related to ISO 9000 please try to write down objectives benefits and the basic requirements and the series of standards and certification steps are also said to be the topmost question one short question i can give you you can go 15 out of 15 in form of short and long and third part it audit may be the short question the various series under iso 9000 to 1994 is also one of the short or the long question which may occur in the question paper in 10th and 11 dear student please do prepare the fifth unit as well as the first unit and the second unit the students who are just like you looking to pass and student want to score can go even with the fourth also i can give third unit as the last option for you all these are set to be the very important questions for the course total quality management if you haven't subscribed please do it immediately by pressing the bell icon good luck